What is very interesting is uh, firstly the position, the geographic position. So we can import uh, materials with boats and we can export cement with boats and we have the quarry just near the sea. I am uh, the director of operation for quarry and crushing. My main goal is to bring the limestone from the quarry to transform it uh, in order to produce cement after that. The topographic area, even if it's beautiful, <laughs> we, we are at the top of two mountains with a land very uh, difficult in access. At the beginning of the operation, we chose to have uh, at the beginning a DI-550, which is a very good drill and perfect to make a lot of production. We want to do uh, the most things as possible as a less expensive price but with this kind of topography, it's not easy at all. On a very small bench, you need to, to do 10 times holes than on a 15 meters flat bench. So uh, you can imagine the needing of uh, drilling in due by this topography, as well as the earthworks needed to go with our drill uh, on those sites. The DX900 uh, can uh, have the same productivity in 5.5 inch holes as the DI550 have. Of course, the DI550 can go in uh, 6.5 uh, inches holes, which is what we are trying to do the most of the times when we have 15 meters benches. But uh, when we are in very difficult area, uh, we cannot go with this machine or oh, it needs a lot of works. The DX900, we can make uh, quite big holes with that and uh, we can go uh, in such lands with an uh, easy facility, uh, less earthwork to prepare the field uh, than for the D550, so it was less time of preparation for our shovel uh, and it was uh, finally cheapest to, to go with this, uh, this drill on the, on the site. It was a, a great pleasure and a great surprise also because it was not uh, in our consideration to look uh, closer about this kind of drill before that. What is uh, interesting for the DX900 is uh, consumption. We are at a very low consumption compared to a D550. We also uh, want to have a capacity of production very near the DI550 in terms of meters uh, per minute. So we are near the one uh, meters per minute we wanted to reach. I like the swivel too, so you're less moving to drill the holes and it's uh, faster for the production. In 20 years, that's the best top hammer I ever drilled with. That's the best one you could buy for the limestone. Even in the hardest moment, it's is easier to support us and uh, we still work as a team and not just a supplier versus customer. And it is very appreciated to have this kind of relationship. Mm -hmm.